Let's admit it, the lives of the wealthy and famous spark our interest. As one of the world's defining luxury capitals, how do you believe the ultra-rich in Dubai spend their money? Welcome to Planet Lux, and in this video we'll take a look at the billionaire lifestyle in Dubai. You may have heard a few crazy stories about the extravagant preferences of super-rich celebrities, but nothing compares to the decadent opulence of Dubai's elite. Today we will give you a list of the incredible ways rich people in Dubai spend their money, from custom-made couture to cars built completely of gold. The super-rich in Dubai appear to follow the saying, if you have it, flaunt it. You may have seen people spend large sums of money on expensive cars and homes, but in Dubai, if it isn't made of gold, it isn't worth mentioning. This is why the city of gold has a very specific collection of objects that the wealthy regard as status symbols. Our list includes some of the most dramatic and outlandish ways people in Dubai choose to spend their many millions, if not billions, of dollars. If it is not covered in gold, it is unlikely to be of interest to the Dubai elite, unless it is instead covered in diamonds. The rich inhabitants of Dubai are said to be infatuated with a glittering yellow metal, giving ancient King Midas a hard run for his money. Whether it's a custom-made 24-karat gold iPhone or a whole Mercedes plated in white gold, the rich kids of Dubai will occasionally flaunt a new blingy item that befits the Emirates' fascination with gold. If you want to see a $2.4 billion custom-made Bugatti Laura Blanc or a gold-decked SUV, head to Dubai because these are owned by Arab billionaires who have settled in the city of gold. If you're not startled by gold-studded autos, your jaw will drop when you see a toilet constructed completely of solid gold. Withdrawing large sums of money is simply too common for Dubai's super-rich citizens. ATMs spouting gold are more to their liking. Isn't it incredible? That, however, is just another usual rich people activity in Dubai. In Dubai, there are ATMs that are not only built of gold, but also dispense gold coins, bars and medallions. It operates similarly to any other ATM machine in that you swipe your card, but instead of cash, gold is dispensed. One such mechanism can be found in the world-famous Burj Khalifa. If you missed out on seeing your favorite celebrity, don't panic since you can hire them for a private encounter. Most of us can only aspire to be lucky enough to take a photo with our favorite celebrities. But for Dubai's filthy rich elite, it's simply a matter of scheduling their favorite celebrities for a private encounter. Celebrities such as Wiz Khalifa, French Montana, Paris Hilton and Chris Brown will perform and even DJ at your party for a fee of roughly 1.1 to 1.8 million dirham, which is nothing for a billionaire. Saif Ahmed Bilhasa, the 14-year-old son of Dubai's famed construction mogul, has a social media account where he has published images with celebrities such as Jackie Chan, Akon, Messi and Nicki Minaj. Yes, you read that correctly. Millions, not hundreds. The luxurious lifestyle of Dubai's affluent class has evolved to certain peculiar spending habits, which may appear absurd to other people but are quite typical to them. When you tell people in Dubai that the number plate costs more than a typical Lamborghini Aventador, they don't even blink. Getting personalized number plates is one of the top things the Dubai's elite spend their money on. It is regarded as one of the defining status markers among the city's wealthy locals and foreigners. That is why wealthy businessman Arif Ahmad Al Zaruni paid a stunning 18 million dirham to purchase the Sharjah number no. 1 license plate. Take a look at the Instagram account Rich Kids of Dubai's series of images to get a glimpse of how much the Dubai elite spend on their gold and diamond encrusted jewelry. Some of the beautiful jewelry flaunted on the social media accounts of Dubai's opulent elite include a 50 carat diamond Bulgari Serpentine bracelet worth $75,000 and Harry Winston's renowned emerald cluster diamond watch at $1,000,000. By the way, if you're watching us for the first time, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you can enjoy our future videos while getting updated. Getting back to the topic... Expensive and luxury hotels have historically been connected with wealthy people's portfolios and the Dubai elite are no exception. Another habit of Dubai's wealthy is to partake in the extravagant comforts offered by some of the city's most expensive and sumptuous hotels. A single night at one of the two underwater rooms at the Atlantis, the Palm, for example, would cost you more than 8 grand. And a night at the iconic Burj Al Arab would cost you a whopping 24k, which is roughly what some of us spend on our annual rent. 
Have you ever witnessed a luxury automobile traffic jam? This is just another Thursday evening in Dubai. Luxury sports cars, particularly those belonging to the super-rich, are a common sight in Dubai. While some of us may only fantasize about driving our favorite supercars, Dubai's rich are known to take their Bugattis and Lamborghinis on errands. The Dubai royal family is also well known for their passion for luxury supercars. His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, ruler of Dubai and one of the world's wealthiest billionaires with a net worth of $13.9 billion, was the first to get a custom-made Mercedes-Benz G55 AMG. It is a well-known truth that Dubai's aristocracy are dedicated fashionistas. The Dubai Mall alone is a testament to the city's insatiable desire for odd fashion. The latest collections of Valentino, Gucci, Prada, Chanel, Burberry and other designers are said to be the first seen on Dubai's super-rich. Dubai is mostly a Muslim city, yet individuals of various faiths live and practice their faith freely. In Dubai, you may see a variety of mosques, churches and temples. However, it might be difficult for non-Muslims to locate places to dine throughout Ramadan. Buying a house is a little tricky, since you have to be filthy rich. However, living in apartments is both cost-effective and enjoyable, and with short-term leases you may move whenever you choose. Serviced flats can be found across the city. They are usually newer constructions that come fully furnished and serviced as part of the rent. Dubai's economy is extremely diverse. You'll be able to earn a lot of money if you start a business and it is successful. As the world's business center, Dubai and the UAE require an inexhaustible supply of services, goods and knowledge. If you have a job and live in Dubai, you will not have to pay any taxes on your paycheck. That means you won't have to deal with the headache of having tax deducted at the point of sale. You can compare the highest paying jobs in Dubai to those in your home country. It's clear that in addition to a pension for the flashy, Dubai's elite has a soft spot for gold. But their fondness for gold extends beyond jewelry and accessories. Dubai is also renowned for its distinctive gold-flavored delights. There's plenty of gold-infused cuisine for the privileged in Dubai to revel in. From the $1,200 cupcake at the famous Bloomsbury Cupcake Shop to the Golden Phoenix, which comprises 23-carat edible gold sheets as well as gold-dipped strawberries all served on a gold-plated cake stand. In Dubai, these gold-plated treats will take your fine dining experience to the next level. Apart from these high-end tastes of Dubai's elite, the city's super-rich also spend a lot of money on their residences. The city's billionaires and millionaires take luxury lodgings to a whole new level, with unique luxury fixtures and interiors designed by prominent artists from around the world. Areas such as Emirates Hills and Paul Jumeirah are famed for their ultra-luxurious homes, with investors willing to spend far over 50 million dirhams for excellent residences that have groomed gardens, in-house lifts, private pools, private beach space and access to golf clubs. Take a look at some of the most expensive residences in Dubai if you're curious about some of the most popular spots for the city's elite to dwell. That is how the super-rich live in Dubai. And with that being said, it's time to end our video. Did the lavish Dubai lifestyle amaze you? Let us know in the comments. Like this video and make sure to subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos like this. We'll see you in the next video.